Let's see. Okay. 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 Yeah. All right. Aloha. Oh, aloha to you. Yeah. Oh. Uh, what's the, what's going on? You haven't heard it? We're going to the beach. Oh. 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 oh, oh yeah. Beach. Yeah. Beach time. Yeah. Oh, but first, let's see. Hello, everyone. Welcome to What's for Dinner. My name is Gordo, and this is my dad. Hello, everybody. He was a chef and restaurant owner for more than 20 years, and he's here to teach us how to cook simple Chinese dishes at home. So if you want to learn more Chinese recipes, please like and subscribe to our channel. Anyways, today we're making zhongji. Yeah, zhongji. Yeah. Zhongji, or sticky rice pudding, is a kind of Chinese version of a tamale where we use sweet sticky rice mixed together with delicious filling and wrapped with bamboo leaves. People used to make this back in the day in poor rural areas. This is something that can be made easily if there were leftover food and rice and it can be stored for long periods of time. So to get started you'll need peanuts, cotton twine, salted duck yolk which is optional, Chinese sausages, chicken flavoring, salt, pork belly, bamboo leaves, and premium sweet rice. In a large mixing bowl, we're going to add in 10 pounds of sweet rice. Make sure to wash the sweet rice at least twice. Then we're going to add 4 spoons of chicken flavoring, 4 spoons of salt, 1 large bowl of peanuts, and we're going to mix it through evenly. Then we're going to add in about 7 spoons of oil in there and mix the oil through the rice. Alright, now that we're done prepping the rice, bring the rest of the ingredients together and we're going to start wrapping it up. So first we're going to grab two bamboo leaves and stack them on one another and then fold it at an angle in half to create a little pocket. Then you can start adding two scoops of your rice mixture in there and add your sausage, any protein you like, yolk, and any other filling that you would want to put in there. Then grab another bamboo leaf and then add it to your bottom layer and add two scoops of rice to cover up the filling. Then you're going to grab another bamboo leaf and layer it on the bottom and start folding it on the slide over slowly and then fold it over on the other side over as well. Then you're going to slowly turn it over and fold the top down. Once you've folded the top part down, and then you can grab a butcher's twine and wrap it around the zhong and tie it around tightly. Then you're going to give it a good smack around to make sure it's nice and tight in there and let's make some more.
Alright, now that we've made a few, let's look at our yield. And now, let's get to cooking. First, you're going to get a large pot and fill it up at least half with water and bring it up to a boil. Once it's at a boil, turn the gas down to medium or to low and then start putting your jong in there and let it cook for 3.5 hours to 4 hours. After it's done cooking, carefully take it out and let it cool down for at least 20 minutes and it's ready to eat. Unwrap the string and the leaves and it's ready to start munching. I hope you all enjoy! Yeah. <laughs> Alright, yeah. well, let's go to the beach then. Bye, okay. everybody. Bye-bye. Alright, everybody.